Hi everyone, this is Josh with Techzone UK and uh, you probably knew that a while ago, um, I'm talking quite a few years ago, um, Ubuntu used to be um, very, um, uh, lots of people would, you know, you'd put wobbly windows and you'd have the cube and things like that on Ubuntu and over the years it's died down for some reason, not entirely sure why. Uh, but in this video, I want to show you how you can get the wobbly windows uh, back into Ubuntu. I'm, gonna be, I'm running 13.10 uh, here. So what we're going to do is there's a couple of little uh, tweaks that we need to do. We need to basically check to see if our system is compatible to run uh, wobbly windows. Uh, and then we need to install CCSM, which is Compiz Config Settings Manager. So what I've done is I put together this little uh, document here. Um, which this will be on my new website that I'll be setting up soon so hopefully by the time you watch this video the website is up but as you can see uh, there's a couple of little things we do um, if the quick note if the website isn't up I'll put this in the description anyway so obviously you don't have to wait for the website to be there basically what we need to do is first of all check to see if our hardware will work so we need to run this little command here um, so if we open up our terminal oh didn't mean to open up that what am I doing there we go. And as you can see, I've got wobbly windows going, so I quite like it. It gives it a lot more, makes things a lot smoother and nicer, I guess. Paste that command in, and what we're looking for is it says not software rendered, yes, uh, not blacklisted, yes, you know, G uh, GLX, um, FB config, yes, uh, all these to be, you know, pretty much yes, and importantly, Unity 3D supported, yes. So. If you haven't got these and some of these are no, try uh, updating your system. So uh, just run sudo apt to get update, and then uh, you could run sudo apt uh, upgrade as well. So you could run that command there, and that would then um, make update and upgrade your system. So hopefully that will pull the latest graphics driver down if you have problems with this. So um, anyway, once that says yes, or if it says yes, uh, we just need to install. Uh, Compiz Config Settings Manager, so CCSM, and the CCSM Extras. So we're just going to paste that line in, hit enter, and then we're going to go ahead and we're going to install that. And as you can see, obviously I've got mine already installed, and it's upgraded 263 packages there. So now what we need to do is open up CCSM. There's two ways you can do it. You can come up to the dash and just type in CCSM. Uh, if you've got the search snaps like I have, you can just type in CCSM, again, bring it up. Or if you just want to do it command line, you can just come in here and do CCSM. Simple. And what we need to do is just scroll down here, uh, and you will see that we have, um, well, my no effects, uh, we have wobbly windows. So what you need to do is you need to just put this little tick here. Now what you'll notice is it comes up with a little window saying do you want to uh, disable, um, which one was it disables, I think it's, uh, let's have a look, uh, one of the uh, window managers, um, snapping windows, that's it, so it disable snapping windows, so you can't Okay, apparently it still lets me to it, but you have to basically disable the CCSM effect of snapping windows. So all you do is come in here, tick wobbly windows, click disable snapping windows, um, and that will then instantly put snapping uh, snapping windows there. So what I'll do in the next video, I'll show you how you can uh, set up Zoom, uh, so you can set this up. This is actually surprisingly useful when doing tutorials, uh, and also being able to. Um, show people stuff on your computer you know on images and if you've got a small YouTube video you can literally zoom in if you can't make it full screen things like that but uh, yeah that's, that's pretty much it on how you can get CCSM to create wobbly windows for you so as you can see look wobbly windows be careful with CCSM though because you can really mess up unity it's very touchy on the effects so don't overdo it you know I have um, a couple of effects going I have my little uh, animations for my mouse in case I lose my mouse and obviously I have the zoom uh, fading windows as normal but that's pretty much it on all the effects I use for CCSM so uh, yeah that's pretty much it so thank you very much for watching if you enjoyed this video then uh, subscribe if you can and uh, if you've got any problems with it then by all means leave a comment below and uh, yeah visit my website because the whole guide will be on there for you to um, use to look at so thanks a lot for watching guys take care